Let's dive deeper into what Abdezizi tells us about the investigation by IPOA. And by now, the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions, DPP, has directed the Independent Policing Oversight Authority, IPOA, to conclude investigations into the alleged killing of 29-year-old Rex Kanyike Masai by a police officer. In a statement, the Office of the DPP wants IPOA to conduct thorough investigations and file a report within 21 days. This comes as Azimio Laumoja One Kenya Coalition demanded that the resignation or rather demanded the resignation of the Inspector General of Police Jaffa Kome and the Nairobi Police Commander Adamson Bungay following the killing of Rex during the anti-finance bill protests on Thursday in Nairobi. 24 hours after Rex Kanyiki Masai was shot in the city center of the height of anti-finance bill demonstrations, his death has attracted a barrage of condemnation, with various actors terming it an act of brutality and a violation of human rights, pointing fingers at the police for failing to protect the demonstrators. The Independent Policing Oversight Authority has commenced investigations into the incident, made contact with the family and visited the scene of crime to establish the facts leading to his death. This, as the late Masai's colleagues termed his killing as a brazen murder, faulting the police for firing live bullets indiscriminately. Kenyas, Gen Z and the nation at large following the assassination last night of Rex Kanyike Masai by trigger happy police. We pledge that his blood shall not be in vain. He will be immortalized in this liberation. You have shot somebody in the streets in cold blood, and yet we have to wait for you to bring a file so that we can move Rex from here. There's me La Umoja One Kenya Coalition wants the Inspector General of Police, Jaffet Kome, and Nairobi Police Boss Adamson Bungay to resign as they faulted police for using excessive force during the protests. It is evident that there's a big problem with our security officers as these tragic shootings are not isolated events. Not long ago, when Kenyans marched for Mandamano, 75 people were killed because certain police officers opted to fire live bullets into peaceful crowds. The opposition and other political actors have also called on the Director of Public Prosecutions, DPP, to prefer murder charges against the officer involved in the shooting, as well as charge Bungay and Kome. All Kenyans live, lives matter, and our police service just know that one day you'll be held accountable for all their lives lost. We further demand that all protesters detained illegally by state security agencies be released immediately and unconditionally. To the Inspector General of Police, we demand that you resign. Koome, we know that you are vicariously liable to the murder with malice a forethought of one Rex, and therefore you must resign, and the DPP must institute a criminal charge of murder against your person.